Hello everyone and welcome to another episode of Agave Talk, your number one source for everything agave. We appreciate you being here with us today. Today I am super excited to be bringing you a bottle you've probably never seen before. This is a a once-in-a-lifetime bottle, extremely rare, Um, not only just because, again, there was only a thousand of these made, it's so rare because of the reason it was made. This is their limited edition, 2020, I take my hat off edition. Me quito el sombrero means I take my hat off, kind of like I tip my hat to you. Uh, This is a bottle of their 70th anniversary, the Cristalino. Uh, But again, the reason this bottle exists, it's because of the COVID pandemic. Yes, Uh, we're about to open this up. The box you can see in front of us, I'm going to show you the bottle. But this, this limited edition was created because of the COVID pandemic. And they're taking their hats off to the people in the service industry and in the industry who were able to continue to support their local communities um, during this pandemic when a lot of things were getting shut down. And it's recognizing the efforts of both Mexican men and women um, who were able to take that on and continue moving forward and supporting their communities and their industry. So kind of cool story, once in a lifetime bottle, in addition to there only being a thousand of these. Um, Unfortunately, in shipping our box got kind of beat up on the corners and on the inside as well Um, again just some of that branding all over on the back i'll get that in focus and let you read that for a moment so it is all in spanish this was exclusive to mexico Um, again just kind of really giving thanks and giving their hat and their gratitude towards a lot of the mexican men and women who helped out their their industry and their communities during this pandemic. So, you know, very sad, unfortunate thing to have occurred uh, during the end of 2019 and throughout 2020. And this is something that Don Julio did to kind of pay tribute. So the box opens up from the side and we get this. So yes, once again, unfortunately, let me take this out. All right here, and you'll notice this is the 70th anniversary, the Cristalino Añejo, but it looks like it has graffiti all over with the big gracias right down at the bottom. I'm going to put this to the side real quick. Unfortunately, during shipping, uh, it was not secured on the inside, and this all cardboard got kind of beat up, but it is what it is. At least the bottle came intact. We also then have this on the inside again, just giving back, saying thank you. Uh, I'll let you read that. I'm not going to read it to you. You can screenshot it, use Google Translate. Uh, Really cool kind of stuff. And you know what? Just thinking about it, what I'll do is I'll end up translating this and putting it in the description below so you can read that as well. Let me put the box to the side and bring back this right here yes bring that down such a cool bottle personally we love the don julio brand i am definitely a fan no not a lot of people are fan of cristalinos uh however we are especially this one others meh but this right here honestly we usually keep a bottle of this in the house and uh just for comparison you can see our regular bottle over here Uh, just the difference. So we definitely have some difference in the neck band. We have our kind of leather, you know, Don Julio 70th edition band up here. But this one, you can see it says 2020 limited edition. We also end up having kind of like this, this medallion. Let me bring this over. We have this medallion here with this leather thong band. Again, with that tipping the hat to you. Gracias. It has a bunch of dons and donas, just some names on there. I'd be very curious to know specifically who these people are. I'll be honest, I do not. Um, but obviously, this is all hand painted and 
these names were chosen for a reason. So if you do know, please let us know down in the comments below. Uh, the juice inside, from my understanding, is exactly the same as the juice that's in here. And again, just really super cool. Once in a lifetime, um, you know, limited edition, only a thousand bottles out there. But again, the reasoning of why this bottle was created is um, because of the COVID pandemic, which is which is wild. They did offer a reposado as well. So their reposado, they did do again another thousand bottles. You could check that out. Check that out online. Uh, <clears throat> but again, I just thought this was really cool. Not sure if or when I'll ever open this. Um, I mean, it's the same juice in here. You know, and we are huge fans of this. And just to have this piece of history, which really what it is, um, I, I just think it's really cool. So with that being said, we just wanted to showcase this. If you've never seen it before, there you go. If you like this video, please hit that like and subscribe, as well as follow us on Instagram at Agave Talk. Also, check us out across all platforms of podcasts, Google, Apple, and Spotify, where you can find the audio-only version of this. So with that being said, thank you for being here with us today and take care.